everyone. I have a formal event tonight, so I get to get all dressed up and I'm really excited. However, there's always the issue of where do you put your insulin pump when you're going to a formal? I was diagnosed with type one diabetes when I was 12 years old. So I went through all of my teenage years going to formals, school dances, proms, trying to figure out where to put my insulin pump. And back then I was a bit more discreet about my diabetes. So I used to like to try to hide my insulin pump when I went to these events. I remember specifically me and my mom trying to figure out where to put my pump for each type of dress that I was wearing. So today I wanted to try and a few of my options for you guys to show you exactly how I would style my pump with each dress. And then at the end, I will show you what dress I'm wearing tonight and my whole look. So let's get started. Okay, so here are my different options. And I already know which one I'm wearing, but I'm still just gonna try all of them on for you guys. This video is gonna be pretty quick because I actually have to get going soon and I'm not done my makeup. Outfit number one. So this one's a little bit fancier, but I love this dress. It's from Mod Cloth. It's from a few years ago. So if I have a puffier dress that kind of goes out like this, I find the best thing to do is, I have shorts on by the way. I have a pair of Lululemon booty shorts on and then I just have my pump attached to the waistband here. So if you're sitting at your table to have dinner, you can just unclip your pump from your waist pouch, bring it down, pull it out, bolus, and then put it back. So that's my little trick for this dress. So this is my Barbie dress. I love this dress so much. So this is a tight fitting dress, so there's really like nowhere to put an insulin pump. So where is it? Well, my trick is to wear a pair of bicycle shorts, so really, really tight fitting shorts. So you could do this or Spanx, by the way, because Spanx would serve two purposes. And then I just tuck my pump to the inside of my thigh here. It's like really tight against my thigh. If you need to bolus at, again at dinner, you just pull it out, go like this, bolus and then you just stick it back into your shorts and if they're tight enough it just stays against your thigh all night and it's awesome because you actually like really can't see it at all it's a good hiding spot option number three so this one's a bit more summery because it's white it's nice and flowy so there's definitely the option to wear your pump in your bike shorts like i showed you before but this one actually has enough space right here so my pump is right there so bolusing for this is a little bit more tricky because if you're sitting at a table you're gonna have to look down your shirt to bolus, but I mean, I do it all the time. If anyone asks what you're doing, say you're giving yourself insulin, that's a pretty good excuse. Outfit number four is less formal, so if you're going out to like a dinner or like a party or something, so I have this sheer blouse with a tank top underneath and this suede-like skirt with a really cool cut. What I personally would do for this outfit and what I do when I wear this outfit is I wear my pump on my back like that because it's super easy to get a hold of, so if I need to bolus, I can just unclip it like this. However, it does mean that your pump is showing, so if you don't like your pump to show, you can just put it on your bra because this shirt is looser, so it allows for that. This is another skirt-shirt combo. However, in this case, the skirt is baggy and the shirt is tight, whereas the last outfit was the opposite. But once again, I would wear my pump clipped to the back like that because it's just super easy to get to. However, if you don't want to show your pump, since the skirt's a bit bigger, you could just, like I showed before, you could just tuck your pump into bike shorts. And I also want to say there are certain products out there like the Girly Go Garter, certain things like that that are kind of like bands that go around your leg and then they allow you to put your pump in there. I used to have one of these but I lost them so I find that bicycle shorts are just as good as those and they're usually cheaper because you can get them at like Target or Walmart for $5. This is my outfit so I decided to go with a very simple like flowy dress. This is what it looks like at the back. It's like just a nice delicate navy blue dress and it's kind of like a wintry event so I thought I should wear like a darker color and this is actually not my dress, this is my friend Ashley's so thank you Ashley for lending me your dress. My pump, right here, there it is. And then to go with this I have this fun faux fur jacket, it's faux, but it's actually a vintage coat, it's from the 1960s so I found it at a vintage store, I was pretty excited about it and I really like it. And it's really warm too. <laughs> so that's what I'm wearing with my dress tonight. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more kind of like diabetes fashion videos like this, make sure to give this video a thumbs up so that I know that you guys like this. And I will see you next week. Bye.